Tennis this court I've often thought of is a, is a small stage for the world. How you're going to play, again, it doesn't matter whether you win or lose, it's how you play the game. Watch it. Watch the ball hit the racket. Okay. okay. That's better. I'm George Wunderlich. I'm now a very old man. I'm in my 89th year and, uh, and loving it. Well, I, uh, I came back, moved back to Austin about 12 years ago. I drove by the place and saw, oh, a tennis court, you know. I knew what a tennis court was, what, we, what they're used for. And uh, so I volunteered to uh, teach tennis here, and I've been doing it every Thursday for uh, going on, I guess, 12 years. Ultimately, we'll try and teach tennis. We'd like to have the name of the game for us. But... We try and teach about three basic principles. The first thing is get your head in the game or get your butt off the court. Now, if you're not going to be here, go away. Don't bother us, you know. So you've got to make a commitment. And the next thing you've got to, we teach you, keep your eye on the ball. Because if you're not concentrated and paying attention specifically to what you're doing, you're going to fail. The other third thing is if you hit the ball right, it'll go right. Translate that to the life in the world. If things are going wrong with you, you probably haven't hit the ball right. So we try to uh, combine or extrapolate our tennis playing into living. The kids being very young, myself being very old, is... Uh, is a problem, of course, and because a greater problem is, is our age. But, uh, for instance, right now we're dealing with very, very young kids, and they have no eye-hand coordination whatsoever. And we have to start off by teaching them how to bounce a ball on a rocket. And I, 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 I can do that, <laughs> but better than they can. And I can't run as fast as they can now, but uh, I can know where I'm going, I think, better than they do. So I can pretty well hold myself in equal to them in, in many ways. One way that I can is I get tired, and I don't, lay as, don't play as long every day as I, as I used to. And then that, that I'm getting old, and that I'm, I'm losing out. See, and the more I lose out, the more their energy over tends to overpower me, because they, they've got tremendous amounts of energy. Uh, well, I think I think this club is is, is a godsend to these kids, and uh, I'm very happy and very honored to be a, a small part of it. The main thing that keeps me coming back is it is my duty, that duty which I have chosen, and which I please God will follow. I was given something some knowledge and experience with tennis. I have something, not much, something to give to kids. I may pass away, what I have will pass away, but if I give it to kids, it will last forever. <laughs>